hello friends welcome to devops tutorial and in this video lecture we will learn how to create a build pipeline so in build pipeline we have three phase first phase is uh, check out the code and clean second phase is start the text execution and third phase is create a war file and deploy to the tomcat server so to creating the build pipeline we have to download the plugins is build pipeline so let's go to the manage engine and manage plugin so I already installed this plugin so it will visible and installed here so this plugin is already installed if you are not installed so let's go to the available section and install this plugin so go to the dashboard so we are in dashboard now and let's just okay so here we have created the three sample project as we discussed like three phases so first phase is clean and uh, in this configuration we did one extra things after the uh, build is completed in post build action we will trigger the another build is test and same thing in the test once the test execution is completed we are executing the deployment so let's go there test and in the post build action we can trigger the project to build is java deploy so the execution is like that one first it will start the cleaning that one once the cleaning is done it will start the execution of test cases and after that one it will execute the deployment so let's create a build pipeline so the here we click the plus icon and select this build pipeline and give the view name okay and uh, here we have to select the project so initial project is java clean this is correct and number of the build you want to display so as of now we are showing three builds and rest of the thing you can make as a static so no need to change here click apply and save okay so we are in uh, build dashboard build dashboard for pipeline okay so so we are in build pipeline dashboard so currently there is no build is executed so it's showing there is no job is associated with this so let's create uh, execute this job to click this option run so we can see here the yellow color is mentioned that one the job is started execution and uh, the green means the job is completed and, and blue means it's awaiting to get the job so let's enable the auto refresh so we can see the current stages of the build so we can see here that the cleaning code is done and uh, the java test case, case execution is also done and the deployment in, in progress so in progress will color is yellow and once it is completed it will color change to the green so we can see here all the faces are completed so we are in dashboard that uh, all the stages are completed for build pipeline so we can see here we can see the time and how many times is taken to complete it and if you want to see the log you can click here and if you want to rerun this job so there is option for rerun we can click here and uh, here is the history you if you want to check the history here and if you want to delete this pipeline you can delete here so let's run again and we can see here it is started the first phase is cleaning and once the build is completed let's enable auto refresh so test cases start execution and how much time it will take it will mention all these things so in this build pipeline we can see the number of builds that we executed in that one and if any build will fail it will change the color okay so let's try to make a build failed in this case so how it will looks so go to the Jenkins dashboard and in deployment let's create a 
failure so for failure we can do one thing we can add execute shell and type anything so the command will not found and it will fail the build so go to the Jenkins dashboard build pipeline and rerun Okay, so deployment is a started execution and we can see here the build is failed. So build is failed because we added the wrong command in shell. So I don't why it's not showing. Let's go this build and if you want to see the log, so console output and we can see here the log. So the log is saying the shell command cannot form okay so with the help of this one we can see how the build is execution and how the each stages we can see with the help of build pipeline so this is the build pipeline complete flow so thank you all please like and comment and please subscribe my youtube channel thank you